everybody, this is Claudia, and I'm bringing you my seventh week update from my P90X workout. Last week was supposed to be my recovery week, but I, I've been very lazy and I've been eating very bad this, this month. And there were a couple of workouts that I was missing from my chart. So as I said to you all, I am not counting the days anymore, but I'm counting the effective workouts that I do. So I used all last week to do all the workouts that I was missing from day one. So what I do is I have a little folder here and I made a, some kind of a chart and I have all my workouts and when I do one I cross, I cross them out and when I miss it then I circle it. So when I do it, I finally do it and I cross it out and I know that I haven't skipped that workout. So last week was my catch up week. So I did all my circle workouts from each week. And then next this week is going to be my recovery week. So I'm preparing to do yoga this morning. I already went for a walk with my dog and had some breakfast to be able to go through the one and a half hour yoga training, which I know it's a pain for many people, including me. I love yoga, let me tell you, but this hour and a half, you really need to be prepared mentally to do it and physically and have the time and I don't know, you just kind of have to prepare for it. Anyway, uh, I haven't weighed myself. Uh, I, I don't really notice any changes with respect to how my clothes are fitting, but we'll see next week when, when after this recovery week and after I take my uh, 60 day pictures so next week uh, hopefully I'm going to be having those pictures uploaded to you and then maybe we will all be surprised. I personally don't see a lot of changes. I have made some improvements this week thanks to the advice of many of you who helped me uh, figure out what I was going to do with respect to my upper body uh, part. So I took it easy this week. I used lighter weights and, and I, I, I did more repetitions so I'm not getting, you know, big like like men. So real quick, uh, we, my husband, uh, who has been very supportive, has been um, encouraging me, encouraging me to take uh, some supplements while I'm doing this P90X. So I've tried different ones. Now I, I just wanted to kind of uh, share this with you. Maybe it will work. So the first. The first thing I'm going to talk about today is the protein shakes, which are my favorite. Then maybe in future occasions, I'll speak about the protein bars that we're using. And also he bought me some vitamins, but I'm not going to talk about, today, uh, about that today. So today I'm going to talk about just uh, the protein supplements. So the first one I'm going to talk about is this GNC uh, Whey Isolate 28. Uh, you buy it at any DNC store. They're usually at the mall. I actually we bought this one for I think twenty nine ninety nine. It was on promotion. They always have promotions going on, and they have uh, it has twenty eight grams per serving of pro uh, of uh, protein. So we, this is really good. It's uh, 140 calories per serving, but it's mostly protein, so it's 28 grams. Uh, I like the taste. My husband didn't like the taste at all. And I like the taste because I was drinking it with milk, which increased the number of calories and doesn't really do as much effect as you should when you just drink it with water. Then when I tried it with water, I didn't like it. So I am with my husband. This is like an uh option. We try the one from Sam's Club that is a big plastic bag, but I, we didn't like the taste. So we kind of go with the taste. So try to, to test which ones were better. So this is kind of a no-no. We didn't like it, but it, it's okay. It's got a good content of protein. Then we try these uh, ISO Pure Low Carb from the Vitamin Shop. Also, there are vitamin shops everywhere. You can find it anywhere. And it has a little bit more calories per serving, 220, but the uh, amount of protein that you take in every serving is higher. So it's 50 grams. So it's almost 
twice as much as, you, as, you, as you're taking here. This one tastes better with water only, but it's much more expensive. For this, how many? For three, three pounds, we paid almost $60. So not a very good option uh, if it comes to economy. So uh, it's, it's okay, a lot of uh, grounds for serving, but normally you just don't have one scoop and you don't just have one a protein shake a day, maybe you have two or three, so that makes it more expensive. And this is our ultimate favorite, and as you see, we, we bought a whole gallon of it, and it's our uh, what American Way Protein uh, Shake. This is a 10-pound gallon, and it has 160 calories per serving, and it has 20 grams of protein. So a little bit less protein than this, and certainly this, but it's much cheaper, it tastes better, it is delicious if you and it's creamier when you make it with this water, you really have the feeling that you're drinking it, uh, you're having a, a milkshake. So, and if you do it with, with milk, then it's, it's, it's really delicious. So, we bought this whole gallon online and we had it shipped to our house and it was only like $56 for 10 pounds, and uh, we drink all the time. We, you know, we have this maybe once or twice a day, and uh, we haven't run out of it. I still have more than half half a gallon. So this is a very good buy. Delicious taste, a lot of protein. Uh, it has vitamins included. So from these three, my recommendation would be this one. I just googled it, American Way, and I just clicked on one of the shops and uh, and I made the purchase and it was free shipping too, so it was good. Um, then maybe in the following uh, update, I uh, will tell you my opinions about the vitamins I'm taking and about the protein bars. I don't like them so much, but it's a good option if you feel like snacking. So that's it for today. Thank you, my friends, for your support. I am doing my calorie counting. Um, I've been good. It's good to have this aware awareness of how much you're eating so you don't go beyond what you have to and then you know why things are not working for you. And just last word that I forgot about the protein supplements, I think they're very important because when you're building muscle, you, you really need to, build, to feed that muscle with real, pure, easily digested amino acids that goes and help you build that muscle faster. The more muscle you have, the more fat you're going to burn. And that works for everybody, boys and girls. Uh, we don't necessarily, girls, you don't, you're not going to get bulky by drinking protein supplements, but it, it's going to help you build your muscle and then it's going to help you bar, burn all that extra fat that you have. And that's what I'm doing. So it has worked very well. Um, and I'll see you around next week and, and I'll tell you more about my, how this recovery week went and hopefully next week's pictures are going to be a little better than the day 30 pictures. So bye-bye and have a great week.